Greetings, Cowboys Nation. Welcome back to our channel. Don't forget to hit the like button and share your thoughts in the comments below. Now, let's get started. On occasion, altering a player's position is the key to unlocking their full capabilities. The Dallas Cowboys seem to be adopting this approach as they approach the 2023 season. Calvin Joseph, a defensive back for the Cowboys, has failed to meet the expected standards, but it seems he is being given a fresh opportunity at the safety position. Joseph is embarking on his third year with the Dallas Cowboys, following his selection in the second round of the 2021 NFL Draft. With only three starts under his belt in the previous two seasons, the ex-LSU Tiger and Kentucky Wildcat appears to be making a change in his approach. Recently, Bobby Belt from 105.3 The Fan tweeted some interesting news. He started that during practice, Calvin Joseph spent significant time working with the safety group. This could be interpreted either positively or negatively, depending on one's perspective. Opting to change positions instead of being released or relegated to a lower spot on the depth chart could indicate that the Cowboys have faith in his skills and are attempting to salvage his position on the team. On the flip side, it could be seen as the team making a final attempt before ultimately letting him go. Joseph has been identified as a possible candidate for being released as fall approaches and this might be the last move before that becomes a reality. The Cowboys have made several significant acquisitions during the offseason, including a trade for seasoned cornerback Stephon Gilmore. Gilmore seems poised to take the number two starting position, which doesn't seem favorable for Joseph's prospects of climbing up the depth chart. ESPN's Todd Archer recently addressed this, stating that Joseph excels as a special teams player, but his prospects on the defensive side remain uncertain. Todd Archer shared his thoughts on Joseph's situation, stating that Joseph is one of the Cowboys' best special teamers, but that's not enough as a former second-round pick who has not taken advantage of his opportunities at cornerback. In Week 15, he gave up two touchdowns in the loss to the Jacksonville Jaguars and was benched in favor of Wright. After playing 37 defensive steps in that game, he played just two in the final three contests. He is, at best, cornerback five, if not cornerback six, behind Nashawn Wright. Moreover, it's worth noting that Joseph is not the only player facing this challenge. Nashawn Wright has also been mentioned as being on thin ice before Gilmore's arrival. Both players must step up their game to secure their spots on the team. In early May, Micah Parsons declared that his commitment to becoming a dedicated defensive end in the upcoming 2023 season. However, that announcement didn't hold for long as Cowboys defensive coordinator Dan Quinn quickly dismissed it. Quinn tried to clarify Parsons' statement by emphasizing his focus on pass rushing, but made it evident that Parsons wasn't assuming a new position. We'll see you in the next video.